guys, it's Reagan, and today we are talking about Captain America Civil War. So, this movie was amazing, and I'm sorry, but my review is going to contain some spoilers. So, the first thing I want to talk about is Spider-Man. I love Spider-Man, and I was really excited that he was going to be a part of this movie, because Spider-Man is my favorite superhero, and after Amazing Spider-Man... I was ready for a new interpretation of Spider-Man, and I was super excited. And I think Tom Holland did a fantastic job. I loved him, and he was integrated into the plot really good. All the new characters were with Black Panther and things like that. I liked um, basically everyone in this movie. It was kind of hard because you're like, oh, when, they, when Captain America and Iron Man were fighting, you were kind of like, oh, but I don't want them to hurt each other, and then... It's so like when Captain America goes to hurting Spider-Man, I'm like, stop hurting him. He's my favorite. But, you know, I mean, it was really good. I love that Ant-Man was in it because Ant-Man and Spider-Man provided kind of a comic relief along with some, a little bit of Falcon and Bucky, best friend, laugh. So that was funny. I liked it. The one thing I have to say that I didn't... Well, there was two things I didn't really like. There was some shaky camera in the beginning, which I'm not really a big fan of shaky camera because it kind of, it doesn't allow me to really focus on what's going on. But I understand that because people like to be able to feel like they're part of the action. The villain was a little weak because it was just another Hydra guy. And I feel like we've seen that a lot. So I was almost hoping there was another villain because like this one human put all these superheroes against each other. So... I am hoping that that villain has a twist, which we did see at the end that he was, when he was locked up, and I don't know, it was pretty good. The airport scene was really good. I really liked how interesting it was. I thought that I heard a lot of good things about it, so I thought it was lived up to the expectation. It was really cool and neat. War Machine did get paralyzed, but nobody died in this movie, which I liked because so many movies, they, like, kill off people and stuff like that. And some people might have that as critique, but since I'm, I don't know, I don't think my heart could handle one of my favorite Avengers dying. So, that's how I felt about it. Um, at the end, like, Captain America's back with the Avengers, like, whatever. The only problem he has is really with Tony, and he's just, like, welcoming. He's kind of like, well, whenever you're ready for me to see you again, or welcome you back in the team, I'll be here, I'll always be there, which is fine. The two bonus scenes, one of them was Bucky getting locked up and kind of getting cured with in Wakanda with Black Panther kind of overseeing that with Cap, and I thought that was a good transition because Black Panther, he was, he realized that Bucky didn't kill his father, so he, but he was good and I'm fine with Bucky now, so he kind of is helping to fix him. The second bonus scene was Spider-Man. And it said, Spider-Man will return. And they're talking about Spider-Man Homecoming, which I am so excited to see. I mean, it's not going to be another origin story. And I'm really excited to see that. So there'll probably be another video about the Marvel releases coming out soon later. But I was really excited, and I thought this movie did a spectacular job. There was, Spider-Man did not switch sides like in the comics, um, and Captain America didn't lie, die, like I said, nobody died. Um, Black Widow did kind of help Captain America at the end, which you can kind of tell the whole movie that she really wasn't on anybody's, like, side side, you know what I'm saying? She wasn't definitive, so that was fine. Um, so, that's what I thought about that movie. Please subscribe, because, guys, like, there's, Disney is owning the box office this summer. So you're going to want to see my reviews because you got to watch them. And then if you want to see them, that's it. So thanks guys for watching and bye.